Ah, Beethoven, one of the great composers of all time, Ludwig von Beethoven. This little melody called Fur Elise. I don't know who he wrote it for, but one of the things I've often wondered about this song, I've often wondered how long I'm supposed to play this part of it before I come to this part of it that goes like this. But one of the neat things about Beethoven, if you think about it, let me tell you, listen to this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All he had was eight little notes, just eight little notes, but oh, what Mr. B did with do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do, lo. All he used were eight little notes, just eight, count them eight like these. He'd mix and match and hatch a batch of catchy melodies. Now I could take two notes and come up with nothing of note. Mr. B took a G and a flattened E and wrote fantastic. And all he had was eight little notes, just eight little notes like these. Which goes to show that one man's scale is another man's symphonies. Quintets, fugues, and sonatas, plus an opera and a few cantatas, using only eight little notes in a row. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Do, ti, la, so, fa, mi, re, do. 